Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Anki, and welcome back to our co-op Let's Play on Shogun 2 Follow the Samurai, which with me is Ptolemy. Hey there. And what have we done last time? I think you're about to go into a bunch of fights uh, with people that want to take your territory, and you're like, nah, I think I'll keep it. I'm, I'm certainly about to have a fight with uh, the Takayama. Yeah, definitely. And maybe in a couple of turns, the Yokozawa from the north as well. Possibly, but I mean, looking at their armor, there's not really a whole b a big or lot of lot of threat coming from there. I mean, compared well, to your think... armor, anyway. Army. Once I fought with the Takayama, it might be a bit of a threat. Yeah, but nah. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. I'm I'm not too worried about it. No. And I attacked Hitachi, took it, and then got attacked in the rear, and then defended it. And now we are basically just gonna regen a few of my men, and then I think I might go for Shimotsuke. Because they um, made it quite easy for me to take. I might actually go there just next turn or something, just because it's so empty right now. Although they, it is a town with a stronghold, which, I mean, it looks like to get like four extra units, or maybe five. So uh, maybe difficult, but I, I could siege them out, as per usual. Well, they have five units right now. If they're building units, then they'll have at least seven, maybe eight. If it's a, it's a uh, stronghold, then yeah, they'll probably have eight units. Yeah, the only thing I am worried about is I can't really move out because of happiness reasons. However, I can move an agent in there. Yeah, I think your best bet is to wait and replenish your army first. Probably, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's... I mean, overall, the grand scheme of things right now is that I'm not able to move out and expand at all. So I'm kind of uh, basically relying on you to take out the guys who are fighting you and then ease the pressure on me so that I can start fighting back because right now I have to turtle because I can't afford to do anything else. Sounds so, familiar. It does, yeah. <laughs> but I'm in a better position this time than I was last time I was turtling. So. For now, uh, I mean, when they start attacking with three armies at a time. Yeah, we'll, we'll see how that works, but yeah. for now we're good. And I'm just trying to get some trade going still. For some reason no one wants to trade me. I guess I'm not exporting Sometimes. the right goods or something. No one wants this stuff. It smells funny. Yeah, that's probably it. Sado, you want to trade? No, alright, screw it. I'm just going to enter. Okay. Well, we'll see if I get attacked this turn. I don't think any of the guys can actually get far enough across my territory to attack me. Not even the ones that are right next to you? No, I don't think they can get uh, close enough. Alright. I think they'll be, like, properly close, but I don't think they can actually get close enough. Alright. Wind still... Going uh, crazy in your house. Yeah, you can hear that, yeah. <laughs> it's been like that all day. It actually died down for a while earlier, but now it's going crazy again. Uh. Oh, well. Oh, they might try... Oh, no, maybe not. I was going to say, maybe they're going to try and attack with uh, those other units as well. But you were right. They're right next to you. Oh, my God, yeah. what are you doing? Oh. They haven't declared war on me yet, but... I no, no not yet. Um, a peace treaty from the Yonezawa. But... Fuck you. Like... Fuck oh, those you. Are the, those are these guys. Yeah. Yeah, they're going to take like three or four turns to reach me. I'm not sure what my uh, my ally is doing right there. Maybe they're trying to defend it. <laughs> but... <laughs> this isn't... Maybe. I mean, you are, you are actually allied with them, aren't you? Yeah, and they, they went right next to me and then they turned sort of back again. So maybe they're not looking to take it. I don't know what they would be doing right there, but... I think if they were trying to take it, they would just have taken it. Yeah. Because they, they could easily have done it there. Either way, their army consists mostly of the levy infantry. Like, all I can see from the 6th unit all the way to the 2nd to last is levy infantry. So, even if it is, or even if they do attack me, it's a pretty shitty army. Yeah, well, it'll beat you, but yeah. Yeah, but I can make men to get rid of it. Yeah, well, hopefully. Anyway, the, uh, the Hirosaki were destroyed by you. Yay. <clears throat> And I have very little to do. Uh, these Nakumata, not sure how, that, or Numata rather. I, yeah, I can't read. Um, the guys to my south east. I thought they were uh, the same as the Takayama for a second because their flag is so similar and the same color, and their provinces are basically the same color. Wait, who, who, which ones are we looking at? Uh, the southeast of me. The people in North Shinano? Oh, southeast, sorry. No, I was in uh, Kozuki. Right. The Numata? Yeah, them. 
and the guys who are right next to my, my Oh city. yeah, they are pretty similar, aren't they? <laughs> they look so similar. I was like, hold on a second, what the fuck? <laughs> I had to do a double take. Yeah, they are right outside here. You can try and bombard <clears throat> them, actually, as well. Actually, I can bombard them. I'm going to. Oh, we failed to cause any damage. That sucks. That is a shame. Yeah, but never mind. At least we, uh, at least we're in a good position to defend. In fact, I might actually recruit another spear levy right now, even though that'll be like literally all I can afford to do. But you know, every little helps when I'm going to be sieged by two people in a row. Yeah. And that is literally all I can do. So I've got to end turn. Um... All right. I mean, I could have sallied forth and attacked them, but I'd rather they attack me in my town. <clears throat> and all that happened for me is also the clan got destroyed, so I'm going to hold up there. I just noticed that I can make Matchlock Kachi. We are, they are way better than Levy Infantry, and they're cheaper. Hmm. I'm not sure how that happened. 485 over 525. Yeah, but what's the upkeep? Uh, 84 over 84. Oh, well, hmm. Yeah. Weird. Their, oh, their range is slightly less, but their reload skill is 29 uh, as opposed to 5. Their accuracy is 29 as opposed to 10, and then the same ammunition. But they're also, uh, they're much, they're catchy, so they're the samurai variant with 10 morale versus 4, 8 melee versus 3, while well, you, you get the general gist of it. Oh, 4 armor is also important versus 1, so they're way better. And they cost the same upkeep and are cheaper. And they also start with two experience over their non-experience. So yeah, why the so fuck why, was I making why, with the other ones? <laughs> yeah, why were you? I only made two of them, I believe. Maybe even one. I think I already had those. Maybe I didn't make any of them. Either way, I'm glad I noticed that before I started making any. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, kind of shitty. But then um, I, I guess they're expecting you to move up to the Yugi Kito. Uh, however the fuck you pronounce that. Instead of going for uh, the matchlock Kachi, so <clears throat> possibly because they are more upkeep, but they're better as uh, as ranged units. The... They're not as good as me in melee. Which ones are those? Um, the Yukai Kitai. Oh right, hold on, are those? Uh... Or the UJ UG Kitai, you get you get I, I don't know. <laughs> Wait, are those the guys on my army that have the Kisha training? You get, oh yeah, yeah, there you go, yeah. I, I guess so, How do yeah. I make yeah, them? Kisha Let's have a look. Uh, I need a military academy, which comes from barracks, just, which comes from cadet school. school, yeah. So that's probably the building I'm not actually going to go into either way. That's the one that I've already got, so. Yeah. I'm, I may go run, in. I'll make them and uh, trade them with you or something. Yeah, exactly, that's what I'm thinking, and I might, I might go into them either way, but... I'll uh, see later. Anyway, I'm gonna have my ninja go over towards Shumatsuke, just to scout out ahead, see what they have over there. Oh, they moved out their army, and still only one unit, their daimyo. Yeah, that's surprising. I thought they would have recruited more. Maybe they don't have any money. I can actually get right up to him and then attack him with the giant daimyo or general, but he'll move away, so there's not much point. So I'll, I'll hold off on that. Um, yeah. any... no, I can't sabotage, too expensive. Well then. I think that's the reason why all generals have to have an army, or all, all armies have to have a general in Rome 2. So you can't move the army up and then attack with the general. Is that really... well, then they could have just made it, like, if the army moved up their movement points, the general can't move out anymore, or something. No, because you, you can't leave an army with the general. The general can't just walk out of the army. No, but I mean they should have done that instead. If they if that was really the the one reason why they ch they changed it, so. Oh, I agree. They didn't say that. I'm just surmising. That. Yeah, I'm just yeah. I'm, what I mean is that if that was yeah. the reason, then they should have done it a lot differently because that's just a mm -hmm. shit reason. It is. Yeah, I agree. But that just seems to be to me the way that they've done it. <clears throat> I don't know. There might be different reasons behind it. Yeah, there, there probably are. I mean, you can't count out the fact that they're fucking retarded. <laughs> yeah. No offence to retarded people, although I can understand why you might be offended that I call the developers of Rome 2 retarded. Because they're obviously way worse than that. Yeah, obviously. Yeah. <sighs> I'm so un-PC it hurts. <laughs> no, they're offering me a last piece to eat before you peace. absolutely rip them apart. Yeah. Well, I'm looking forward to that. Here they come. Wow. Are they actually going to attack, that's, or are they just going to That's all of his own range. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Oh, fuck me, it is. <laughs> um, 
do I auto resolve or do I? I don't know how many I would lose. Yeah, it might honestly be smart in fighting it because your then your gates won't get fucked, and I think they do. Actually, do they? Oh, is that only when you attack? Not I don't know. Um, it says I can fight on the battlefield. I don't know if that means I would sally forth. forth. I don't know. Is that an option? I don't know. I mean, it says retreat, fight on the battlefield, or auto resolve. I guess the fight on the battlefield. Just, my city. Yeah, just means that. The, the yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna fight and see what happens, but yeah. it should be it should be in the city. Yeah, it yeah. is. <clears throat> should be good to go. This I'm uh, yeah. not worried at all. Yeah, I, I'm absolutely fine with this. I'm surprised it was an auto resolve range. I mean, it was a pretty big advantage, but still. Yeah, well, I mean, I've got a lot of line infantry. Yeah, the game is a lot more generous towards uh, auto resolving in this game, it seems, than it was on uh, Rome Two. Yeah, it is. I mean, Rome 2, it's ridiculous how many garrison units you get in Rome 2. It is, but yeah, that's that's they did that most likely to make up for the fact that you don't you can't have regular units in your cities anymore. Well, you can if you leave a general there. Yeah, exactly. And to be honest, it's quite easy to do that. Like especially later on in the game when you can have tons and tons of armies where you don't really need them anymore. You can just leave them regular or like in places where you want them. Yeah, I mean, I've gotten to the point where in my my uh, non-recorded games where I've I've recruited generals just because they increase happiness in a place yeah. and just left them in a province. Yeah. Like, don't use them at all. Just left them there to increase their happiness or increase the tax rate or something. Yeah, that's not even a, a bad idea. Yeah, it, well, it works quite nicely. I mean, they have to weigh out. You know, it costs 150, I think, every turn, but you got to weigh that out between the, the benefit of having them and, ha and not having them. Is it upkeep for generals? Yeah, 150. I didn't know that. Yeah. It might change depending on, um, you know, like, I don't know, some other shit. But... So Wait, Lady are Garrison. you, uh, oh yeah, you've got your um, your boats in range as well, don't you? Uh, yes, where's that button on the, on for the that right thing? should be. On the right? Yeah. I don't see it. Oh, that's weird. Maybe it only so, starts after you start the battle. Uh, maybe. I don't see any buttons that I would normally have. Uh, not not normally have, I mean. So, maybe it'll pop up in a minute. Yeah. Hopefully. Anyway, where do you think they're going to come from? Wow, that's it's actually really badly downhill in most directions. Yeah. Alright, hold on. I'm going to move everything off the walls so I can see what the fuck is going on. Wow, I'm actually getting really bad lag right now. Yeah, it's quite a few men. Yeah, I, I've got a lot of men. Okay, everyone off the walls. Now, I want to put line infantry on every wall. There we go. Put some there. Oh, I just put the same fucking unit in two places. Because I'm an idiot. Smart. Yeah, I know, right? I like fucking genius. It's the way I like to do it. Just have them do double work. Yeah, I'll just uh, clone my units. Yeah. That sounds totally legit. Sounds like uh, an easy way to win this game. Yep. Alright, so I've got enough line infantry to go all the way around my entire thing with some to spare. <laughs> and my matchlock catchy to spare as well. Yeah. So these three guys that are separate right here, those are my, those are my uh, ranged units that I've got left. Alright, so I'm going to put... I'm going to line these units up so that I can... Put them where there's going to be. Wow, those line infantry are actually better than the Matchlock Kachi. And it, it's debatable. They're better ranged units, but they're not as good in melee. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. And morale's higher as well on the Matchlock, but uh, or the Kachi, I mean. But still, they also cost more money. Oh, there are more of them so, though. It's two hundred versus one twenty. Yeah, so they probably are better overall. Yeah. All right, so we've got spears set up like all over the place. Um. Let's see, where are these spears? I'm not really too bothered about these. These are all the garrison stuff. Eh, stick them like that. The garrison have, like, no experience, so... Uh, I'm going to give you the generals. Yay. So you can... Basically you know, work not, with those. Not do all that. <clears throat> well, no, you might want to go out and... Um, yeah. And we are ready there. to defend, wow, sir! Okay. So they're literally coming from all over the place. It's not too bad. Let's no, see Levy, unit, levy, though. levy. Levy, Levy, Matchlock. Well, as 
so tempting to start running at them with just the horses, but I can't. I just get obliterated by guns. Yeah, and yeah. the fact that there's. Um... Do you have your... Oh yeah, I, I, I do see the naval support. Yeah. <laughs> I just I was just gonna ask you. Yeah, I figured you were. Yeah. The one levy infantry unit looks really tempting, but nope. How, how can I aim it? Uh, once it's ready, like it takes like three minutes or so. You just click it, and then you'll see like there's a big circle, and then you can change oh, okay. focus. Okay, so I can't. There, yeah. You can't do so it yet. I can't yet. see how. Okay, I can't see how big the actual circle is. It's gonna it's be, a lot. Yeah. I, it's probably bigger than you think, because like when you okay. even focus, there's already a quite large area. Okay, fair enough. Which isn't necessarily a good thing, because if you really want to aim it like in a specific a specific place, then. Yeah. But hey. Fair enough. So my plan here. I know it's fairly obvious, but I want them to come in, get shot a few times, and as soon as they're about to charge the walls, I'm going to pull everyone off the wall and then charge the uh, the spear levy onto the wall. So by the time they actually start climbing the walls, my guys will already be waiting for them. Cool. Whereas they're not going to have too much uh, people coming for the walls, I reckon, though, because most of their army is just ranged. Possibly. I mean, these levy infantry are ranged, right? Yeah, they are. I mean, yeah, they only have like one Yari Ki unit. A Yari Kachi unit, even. And yeah, a bunch one of Yari Kachi. Ki. And then like one Yari Ki there, and two here, yeah. So four melee units plus the generals. Yes, yeah, so they're probably going to stand there and shoot at me, which yeah, is not going to work in their favor. No way they're going to. I mean, they've got levy infantry. Yours are about five times as good as theirs for each unit. Oh, wow. We're shooting already? Wow, that was a good volley as well. They're shaking already. Holy crap, that was, yeah, that was nuts. It was like 25 kills in that first volley. Those are the only guys who are shooting so far. Uh, that unit's oh, wavering, wow. nearly gone. Bunch of horses got shot too. Still, oh, it's broken, there you go. First one Holy gone. cow, how are they so good? <laughs> these guys are a lot better than mine. Yeah, these are line infantry. These uh, Yari Ki are about to go as well. <laughs> Yeah. Second guy, Kimmy. I'm gonna have to pull these guys off the wall though. Oh, a good volley just before you get off the wall. 20 men. Unless, th unless they're gonna, gonna stop. Yeah, there we go. They're coming off now. All right, move. Wow, this is an absolute wreck. All right, spears are going onto the wall now. Like these enemy men aren't even like doing anything. They're just walking. They're not even shooting yet. <laughs> just, I, I think they're actually going to start climbing the walls with their range units. Oh, that's the way I like it. Okay, so we are already on the wall, and they're coming up into our unit here. I'm going to inspire oh, I... this unit right here, make them shoot even faster. No, I don't really want these guys shooting, to be honest. Can I put you on the wall? No, yeah, unit's put broken. These, these guys over there. Oh, the Yari Ki are coming back with 22 men and 21. <laughs> are there any others climbing the wall? Or? Nope, everything is no. fine. There's one unit that's on the other side which is broken. And then there's the three general units, or two general and one Yari Ki. Alright, nice. There's, uh, the most, the biggest, well, threat, I guess we'll call it, is those three units, but it's no threat. Yeah. It's just the biggest blob, let's call it that. You can, do you have your um, ability ready yet, by the way? Uh, yeah, I do. Might be able to throw it right on the edge there. Just make sure it doesn't hit your wall. There's no need. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty big Yeah, it is, thing, isn't it? it? Alright, let's put it, uh... There. Actually, yeah, yeah. I was gonna say, you could also use it on the generals, but... Meh. I could, but last time I did it on the generals, they just moved. Yeah, exactly, that's what I was thinking. Oh, they're climbing the wall. Have I got... I think I've got, uh... That's line infantry, get off. We'll get, uh, we'll have these spear levy get on the wall. There we go. Alright, these Yari Kachi are wavering. That's bound to hit a few men there. Maybe even, oh, one of them is sort of running. Oh, there we go, there we go. Come on. Oh. Go on. Hit something. Oh, oh, one of them, there we go, too. Yeah, there we go. That was nice. That was quite good. Yeah. Could have been better, but... Yeah, but it was hard to hit anything, really, at that point. Yeah. Oh, shit, they're actually climbing the wall there. It, hit the, it hit the wall for 11 damage. 11% 11 damage. Oh, generals are coming up. Alright, that's fine. I'm going to... Uh, inspire them, so they'll start shooting faster. 
Right, we've beaten the guys off the wall. That's good. Let's get these spearmen off the wall. And we'll put these... Uh, oops, these gun units back on again. Victory not that we really need to, but we're going sir. to anyway. Yeah, victory is definitely assured. Make sure not to end the thing, by the way. I can chase off a lot of units. I'm actually going to start running my horses out. Okay, I will uh, continue if possible. Yep. <clears throat> Looks like the levy infantry is uh, coming up now. Indeed. Indeed, we do. So yeah, the reason I said I was going to take the guys off the wall and then replace them... They're climbing uh, is... here, by the way. Yeah, I'm just, uh, just about to switch them over. Alright. The reason I say that is because every time that you've been protecting your thing, I've noticed that they've already been inside the wall long before you even put the guys on to go to the wall. Yeah, exactly. And it's much more effective if they're already on the wall when... Uh, yeah, that's true, although I, I always like to get, or try and get another volley off. I can understand that, yeah, but half the time they end up just staying on the wall and getting, this and getting themselves killed when they do that, so... Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, I think this is pretty much over now. Yeah, I'm gonna start chasing units down. Yeah. Yeah, I think they're all broken now. Where's the... Okay, there's still a unit that hasn't broken somewhere. Apparently, because mm. the battle meter is still. Oh, there we go. go. Uh, I can't continue. Oh, oh yeah, oh. it's uh, multiplayer, isn't it? It doesn't happen in Shogun 2. Doesn't it? Well, this is for the samurai, not Shogun 2, so it could have Yeah, done. but same uh, principle, I guess. Mm. Yeah, in room in room 2, you can continue, <clears throat> can't you? Yeah, you can. That's one thing they added that's actually good. Yeah, one of the very few things. Yeah. There are a couple of things they've added that are good, I will give it that, but. But then in co-op they took out the ability to do anything for the other player while the other yeah. player's turn is going on so it's great and they, they took out the ability to you know finish your campaign games <laughs> yeah <laughs> that too <laughs> yeah how much did we lose we lost 271 men not even 10 percent they also took out the ability to have fun yeah <laughs> oh dear it's true though i mean doesn't actually say how many people I killed with the thing, even in the breakdown. That sucks. But regardless, those guys got their asses kicked. Yep. Uh, okay, and so, you know those they guys that I was saying? Yeah. yeah, yeah, they've declared war on me as well, which nice. is nice. Yep, that's lovely. <clears throat> yeah. Oh my god, so many allies they have, but none of them will join, probably. Uh, yeah, and I, I don't seem to join unless oh. they're already at war with Enough me. Really Guess what they tried to give me? The peace treaty. Uh, I was going to say AIDS. <laughs> <laughs> they tried oh, the to... Edo is also declaring war on me. Oh wait, aren't they? That's shit. Yeah. That's my ally. Yeah, they're your allies. Do you, what the fuck? Do you not call me in there? Yeah, I can do that. Okay, good. Why is fucking everyone declaring war on me? What did I do? Like, what exactly did I do? I don't know. It's, 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 it's the same thing as Shogun 2. They, for some reason, they always, when you play co-op, they just have one person get every single war, and the other person is completely fine. Yeah, that's dodgy. But yeah, that that army, it's coming towards Hitachi, though, so... Maybe a good reason for me to uh, declare war on them. If they're right there. I guess. I mean, how many provinces do they have? One? Yeah, I think so. If they have one province, you just walk past and take oh, it. Oh, actually, yeah. <clears throat> but, yeah, I'll have to see how that works. I don't All think right. I'm actually allowed to attack them unless I would have joined you. But then if I joined you, they could have taken the town right there, which would have been bad. Yeah, so... For now, I'll leave them. Yeah, for now. So, yeah, three turns until my spears are replenished. Well, there's actually literally just two units that need to be retrained. Nice. And one of them's going to be done next turn. And the other one's going to take three turns. So, really, that was uh, pretty pathetic. I'm going to... No, I'm not going to move this ship, actually, because I think those Yokozawa guys will be in range to uh, attack next turn. Maybe. It'll be close. And if they aren't, I'll just shoot them then. Yeah. Uh, but, yeah, I can... Re oh, I'm actually going to run out of money because my trade agreement's closed with those guys. Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, I'm now minus 47. Uh, well, if you uh, need money, I've got some. 
Oh, there's some guys here who are friendly who can trade with me, so I'll see if that works. There we go. Yeah, I've got a trade deal with them going. Nice. And these guys... No, there were some guys who could trade. Uh, I can trade with these guys, but they're hostile. Well, we'll see if they'll take it anyway. I need the money, so... We might be able to come to an agreement. If I pay them 140. Um... No, because you'll probably break it next turn because you're hostile, so <laughs> no. I, I don't think I'll be just giving you away money. I can barely afford what you're asking anyway. No. Uh, no, so there's nothing I can do. I'm literally just going to have to sit here and uh, and weather the storm of attacks. Right. <clears throat> so I'm being the bait, basically. I just noticed in that town that I took Hitachi, I actually own a Samurai Dojo already, so I was making two... Um, Matchlock Kachi all the way back in Kazusa, which I might end up, end up cancelling now. But I think I'll keep them anyway. I can use them. Oh, I thought you. Uh, I thought you knew you already had them, because I noticed that. No, uh, yeah, I, I, I knew before, but I forgot. Like I, I said it in the last episode, but I completely forgot about it. All right. But anyway, that's fine. I'll just make some over here as well. Um, yeah, a little bit worrisome. I don't know what they're planning on doing. I kind of want to go for Shimotsuke really soon here, but. I think I'll wait at least one more turn and see if they attack me. And I'd, I'd like to, I mean, if they're going to attack me, please do it in Itachi. Because I've got my entire army there. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't make sense that they would pick the strongest point to attack. Yeah. I mean, that's, what? Rule number one is don't attack the enemy's strongest point. <laughs> unless you absolutely have to. And you don't absolutely have to. No. Alright, so now the, <laughs> the army over here in Shimotsuke. Now it consists of two generals, rather than just the one. Oh, good god. It's, uh, it's getting somewhere. It's always going places. Yeah. Um, anyway, besides that, I really don't have a whole lot to do. I am working on shipyard research. Yay. Um, what thrilling turns we have. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I assume no one still wants to trade with me. You want to trade? Might be able to come to an agreement. Come nope. Alright, get out of here. Excuse me. I have to point out that I probably did lose less men in uh, in in doing that battle manually than auto resolving. Yeah, that's true. That's so why. It was uh, worth it. Yeah, it was uh, was definitely worth it. Yeah. I'm I'm thinking by the way the Edo or Edo or whatever. I'm wondering yeah, yeah. if they're coming through my territory to go towards you, because it means that they only have to take out the one guy that's next to me, who I'm nearly took out. Oh wow, really? Oh yeah, this will be fucking easy. Um, I think I will also resolve this one. Yeah, it's not much point in finding that. Yeah, lost 44 dudes. Yeah, it's that's fine. definitely worth it. But um. Yeah, anyway, so I think they they maybe just are going through my territory because they're allowed, and then they'll just take out that one guy I'm at war with, and then they can come towards you. But if they do that, I'll just attack them in the rear. Diplomatic yeah. bullshit or not. No, they're going towards my port for some reason, <laughs> unknown to me. That, that's weird. Like, why would you do that? I have no clue. I'm actually curious if those guys that just attacked me then again, my general just increased in rank, and it's now autumn. Um... Oh, wow, nice. I'm curious if, yeah, they have like nothing left at home. Oh wait, never mind. They've got a whole other army over there. But uh, Etchu is basically completely undefended, except for uh, two units, like one Yari Kachi and something else. That's the that's the main problem with these sort of things where you get attacked from several sides constantly. You can't go out and, or at least not with your entire army. You can't go out and take it because they'll just yeah. get taken in the rear. And even if I took a smaller army out to attack, even if I took it, that army would just get attacked by a large one, and then we'd be, you know, uh, we'd be weak in two areas. Yeah. So it just makes no sense. Nope. Uh, so I can either have plus one to the melee attack of all traditional units under this man's command, or plus one armor of this man's bodyguard. I don't have that many traditional units. I will give you some in the future, though, with my samurai and stuff. Yeah, but at that point, is this general still going to be alive? Don't know. There's 24 turns in a year. Yeah, but he is 40 years old already. Yeah, but 24 turns. <clears throat> yeah, true. All right, I'll I'll get the plus one for uh, that thing. Good boy. All right. Oh, I could get defender and get plus two armor anyway. Oh yeah. Uh. 
more accuracy, more command at sea. Oh, plus one command when attacking on land or at sea. Yeah. So really, the first level is just just choosing which way you want to go later on. Yeah, I went for the right tree. Yeah, because logistics, it's got to be done. It's um, plus five percent replenishment rate and plus ten percent campaign movement. It, <laughs> there's just no contest. Yeah. Not that I'm going to be moving anywhere, mind you, but the replenishment rate will be useful. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Can be more in range, good for me. I always just move everywhere so fast. Did this the Yontazawa move? Do they move back? What? The Yontazawa. Yontazawa. The purple guys, did they move back? I don't think so. So I don't know if they've moved or not. But I don't want to move my ships out because I can actually use them in the I, I, I think they did move actually, it's just that they have a freaking like a lot of land to cover. I think they'll be there in two turns. Alright, well I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm minus eighty income right now. Which sucks. I'm gonna be start running out of money um turn after next. Ooh, an enemy shinobi has been detected, and it is indeed autumn. <coughs> minus ten percent wealth. Oh that's crap. Uh, an enemy. Ah, there's a ninja. They just made one. Ah, they're finally making an army. Nothing too uh, serious just yet, but. Yeah, I may actually have to disband just one of my spear units. Yeah, that's possible. My cannon range is done. Let's see, what can I make? I can make cannons. That is surprising. Wooden cannons. Uh. Wooden cannons? Yes. What, what good is a wooden cannon? It shoots logs. <laughs> <laughs> a wooden cannon would just fucking catch on fire the first time you shot it. <laughs> Two morale. <laughs> 500 range, 10 reload skill, 10 accuracy, 8 ammunition. Operational. Four guns. Operational? Not for long it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> I might make one or two just to see what they're like. I mean, obviously they're new units, but not right now. They're expensive and I can't really... Oh, I don't know. If I can move them, unlike the fucking cannons from Shogun 2, then they'll be good. Like, the Shogun 2 cannons were horrible, because I couldn't move them. Yeah, it's like the giant ballista in uh, in Rome 2. I was going to get some of those, and I, I did get some on my uh, my offline campaign. And uh, <clears throat> I keep calling it offline, but you know what I mean. Yeah. I, I got some of those, and I was going to move them about, and then I realized that they are fixed artillery. So you plop them down, and you can do nothing with them. Yeah, exactly. That's why I think... I think operational means that, like, I can move them around, isn't that what I mean? Or just a, is it just operational guns for... I've, I've no idea. I, you probably can move them around. Let's see, uh, let's just have a quick look here. Poor accuracy, very low amount, no, no, no. it doesn't say as a negative thing that you can't move them. Wooden cannons, as the name suggests, are made of wood. Oh, really? Really? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, was, I was just joking, but seriously? <laughs> Uh, the fuck? Let's, let's see. Uh, can't really see anything that says it, it can't be moved, so I assume it can be. Yeah. I mean, they're only wooden as well, so they can't be that heavy or anything. Yeah, and I wouldn't have thought they would give you, you know, static cannons immediately. Well, I don't know. I mean, if anything, the the first cannons would be the the shittiest ones that you can't move and, and stuff. I guess. Mm, yeah, I suppose. Maybe. Does that mean you're going to be able to get Gatling guns later? I don't know. I think. Maybe I mean we'll be, we will be, but I guess, I, I guess you mean like if I can make them with this particular building tree. Yeah, that's what uh, I mean. Let's see. Next thing is parrot guns, and I still that still doesn't give any monetization, so that's good. Artillery Academy gives minus one. Okay, so that's when it starts giving um, unhappiness, and it also gives Armstrong guns, and the Arsenal gives uh, Gatling guns. So yeah, you do need to get monetization. Uh, unhappiness, but you do end up being able to make Gatling guns. Oh, I should point out my modernization is like halfway to level 2 right now. Oh, okay. Mine is still uh, right at the end, uh, beginning of turn 1. Yeah. Or of uh, turn 1. Thingy 1. <clears throat> I think that's because I've gone for uh, the line infantry stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't made anything that has modernization yet. Alright, I'm gonna wait uh, probably two or three more turns before my next units arrive and then I'll have a decent sized army. How many men do I have right now? 5, 10, 13, plus the 4 that are coming, so that'll be 17 units. And then I'll make one wooden cannon and there'll be 18 and I'll probably make two more katana or something at some point. Alright, and... Sounds good. Let's see if what those guys are gonna do now, the freaking Edo. Oh, and let's see if anyone reaches you this turn. 
I don't think they will. I don't think so either, but we'll look. Oh, the Obama, they should be allies to us, or at least they should be friendly toward us. And they seem to be helping out because they're attacking your enemies in the rear, it looks like. Are they? I don't know. Oh. At least they're in their territories, it's something. It would be nice if they were. And they're the uh, pro shogunate as well, so. Oh, so yeah, they might be. Alright, they're getting more troops together. Oh, peace treaty. How about you go fuck yourself off? <laughs> They're just, they're just gonna keep trying that, aren't they? Oh, here's another ally or enemy that wants to be friends with you. Oh yeah, they, they definitely want to be friends with me. What are you doing there? Yeah, what are they doing? Well, actually, Wait, hold I, don't, on. I don't care. As long as they're not attacking me, they're fine. I think I got it. They're, you know, <laughs> they are on their way to you. Did you see, after they, they are moved their army, a bunch of ships moved all the way up north. Hold on, I'll see if I can find them. Uh, if we can even still see. I saw them around here somewhere. Maybe we can't see them anymore. Anyway, yeah, they had some ships around uh, here or something that were moving about. And I think they might be getting those all the way over there just so they can get to you. So if I, oh, wow. I, I could help them out by taking these guys out and then they can get through this territory towards yours. Yeah, go ahead and help them attack me. <laughs> that, that'll be good. Yes. Yeah. All right, they will be attacking me next turn. The uh, the Yakuzawa. Let's let's hit them with my my ships. Oh, we killed uh, twenty of the general's bodyguard. Nice. Yeah, that is nice actually. I I like that, especially because it means the second they get into range of my guns, they will die. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, this uh, this Matsuhiro or Mat Matsushu Matsushiro army, the the Cyan guys. They've got a lot of Yari Ki. They have at least five. And they've got at least four Yari, uh, Yari Kachi. <clears throat> so they've got a a pretty decent army there, actually. Yeah. Like for a field army. Not for sieging, but for a field army, they've got a pretty decent army. Indeed. I've also just encountered Obama. Let's see if he can uh, give me any tips on politics. <laughs> What, the way America's being run currently? Yeah, I doubt for that. that. <laughs> um, yeah, so I am literally going to run out of money next turn. So um, can I get a loan? Yep. I hate to ask. Actually, hold on. Um, I could just get rid of one of my units of spear levy. No, you probably need all, all the units, especially since there's another army coming right now. Yeah, you're right. Okay, well... Alright, well, I'll end turn and then you can... Well, yeah. I don't know how much you want. Well, I don't know. Um, well, I'm minus 81 per turn right now. So, you know, you choose. Alright. Uh, I... So, it's not like I'm really badly going to go into debt, but... Yeah, but I mean, might as well get a sword as soon as possible. <clears throat> yeah. Let's see. How happy is this town? Five. I think I'm going to move out... Spare levy as well. Yeah, speaking of, speaking of it getting sorted out as soon as possible, can you do it before you forget? Yeah, hold well on. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, right, I won't forget. Alright, so I can actually move the Shimotsuki out. Can I have him start going over here as well? Oh, it's not a Shimotsuki anymore, is it? Is that what they were even called before? Is it sh Shizangumi Shizun is what it's called. Yeah, but what were they called before? Uh, Metsuke. Metsuke, right, yeah. I think. All these stupid Japanese words. Anyway, um, right, I got two more made here as well, making the wooden cannon. These guys will be here next turn, and then I think we'll start moving out and then take that town out. Right, uh, diplomacy. I also want to trade with the Obama if they want to trade with me. I can't trade with no. them, which kind of sucks. Yes. Uh, Nagaoka. Right, payments. Offer. This is a good day. Uh, a six hundred. Good conversation. Yeah, that'll do me for quite and a while. Perhaps a right. profitable outcome for all. Thank you. But I demand peace. <laughs> Aren't we already at peace? <laughs> no. What are you talking about? Right. Oh, I, okay then. Well, uh, fine. Another Mashlokachi, and that will bring me to twenty units, and bring me to an even number as well. Uh. They finally got a, a halfway sizable army in uh, Shimotsuke now. Yeah, but it's still nothing compared to mine when it's done. Well, yeah, but true, but you know. You know, you know. 
yeah, you know. I'm gonna establish a spy network here. So are you gonna keep those uh, those levy infantry? For now, yeah. Considering the matchlock catchy are just better for the same price. Well, yeah, I will probably get rid of them, but I'll just do it after I take Shumatsuke because I'll need them soon. Well, you can always leave them behind for uh, morale stuff. Yeah, that too. Alright, so I'm definitely going to get attacked during this end turn. Yep. Oh, there's another army. Wait, hold on. That's a different... Wait. That is different. Yeah, or I'm a, I'm a piece of those guys. I don't know about you. I have no idea. I'm just assuming I'm at war with everyone right now. <laughs> it's a safe assumption. Another peace treaty. <laughs> Here yeah, we go. Yeah. Are they going to be... Nope, they're not. This looks like another auto resolve, to be honest. Um... Yeah, I think I will. Lost uh, 422 men, that's actually quite a lot. Yeah, but... But their entire right. army is dead, so... Worth it. <clears throat> I think, uh, with that next army, I'll have to actually fight, uh, hatch, have to actually fight it. Yeah, probably. Something like that. And I can no longer trade with the Takayama. For some reason. How much time do we have left? 20 minutes. Okay, plenty of time. Alright, so... Yeah, army is going to be replenished in one turn, three turns... Everything's like one turn. I don't think they even used the line inventory in the last battle, because they're all fine. Yeah, indeed. But, yeah, whatever. Um, are they... These fucking bastards are just out of range. Oh, no, they're not. They're in... They're out of range, but I can still bombard them. Lol. Yeah, did 60, uh, 66 damage to one of their Yarikachi. Not bad. It's also one of the Yarikachi that I can't see. Oh, no. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? Oh, I also know they have a uh, a Levy infantry in there now oh, as well. Oh, they're on the way. Look, there they are. Hmm? Oh, and I can see their entire army now. Wow, that's going to be a <laughs> piss take to take care of. Right, so they got two generals, one spear yeah. Levy, and everything else is Levy infantry. No experience whatsoever, except for the one spear Levy. So that's a piss take to take care of. Yeah, I, I wouldn't actually mind fighting that, because yeah, that would be, be fun. some really nice experience. Yeah, it would just be a fun fight. <laughs> yeah, because these line infantry, I mean, yeah, they're, I'm sure there's better units, but these are half decent. For now, they're like six times as good as any levy infantry unit. Exactly, and I think they're better than the matchlock catchy, even though the, the matchlock are better in melee. There's not a lot in it. Yeah. I mean, they cost more, yeah, but I, I think I would rather yeah, have the Yeah, I would rather have the line infantry as well. <laughs> But yeah. I can't right now. Yeah, so it's why am I just sitting here. around here? Oh wow, I'm minus 171 per turn now. Oh crap. It's because I can't trade with those guys anymore. They're just cutting off my trade routes. Uh, I now have... Uh, I think you might be right about not being able to not... Uh, to, uh, what do you call that? Like uh, talent tree, the clan development thing. I think you're right about not being able to not do something. I think you have to go yeah. for something. You do. You have to research something. Well, that's a bit annoying. Yeah. So at some point, you're gonna have to get modernization because you don't have a choice. Uh, let's see. This gives plus one to modernization and clan development. I don't think I want to go for that. I mean, you can put it off as long as possible by picking the ones that don't change the modernization. Yeah. But eventually you have to do it. These both give modernization. <laughs> I think I'd rather go for arms deals, because then at least if, if I do want to make some gun units at some point, I can do so. Yeah, I've already got that one. Uh, why can't you just turn it off? I mean, what the hell? I don't know. You should give it the option at least. Alright. It should do, yeah. Anyway, uh, also my Shinsengumi ranked up. Where are you at, Shinsengumi? Where did I put you? Oh, there you are. How did you level up? Huh? He's in an enemy or in the regular turret or just he's not in the town or anything and he leveled up anyway. It's huh. pretty good. Uh, coercing troops and instilling discipline or converting provinces and inciting riots. That is a really good trade actually. Yeah, I would go with that one. Yeah. Wait. Holy shit, I can also give him minus two to the happiness in enemy provinces where there's minus present. <laughs> nice. Just have him in enemy Ooh, territory. Oh, Musashi is unhappy. Musashi? Is that my Where did Hido come from? Oh yeah, I noticed that before, yeah. 
Uh, ooh, yes. Plus one to zeal when inside a vault. Plus one to repression in provinces when it's mana present. And plus five percent to the chance of escape. Fuck that. Boastful samurai it is. Alright, go to Shimotsuki. I need some eyes on them. Oh, oh god. That's not good. The eyes you're about to take it. Well, aren't we allied with them? Yeah, but I want it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, yeah, attack it quickly. I guess I could technically... They'll come in as reinforcements. I, yeah, but I can't reach it. But what I can oh. do, I think I might be able to do, is do the old what trick. Oh, that's my ninja. <laughs> Was that not what you meant to that do? That is not what I meant to do. <laughs> Sabotage the Aizu, I can do that. But, uh, no. Army... Well, yeah, if you can attack with your general, then their army will come in as reinforcements. Yeah, exactly. Just let them do all the work. That's what I'm planning. Yeah. Yeah, we can reach them. All right. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna actually fight this since we have the reinforcements. That is. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh my god. They have a, a good army though. They have. Uh, their daimyo, then one spear levy, and their entire rest of the army is a white tiger force. I don't know what they are, but they sound really good. White tiger force. I would be scared of that. Yeah. Right, I lost 211 men. Sounds That's good like to me. Nothing. Uh, I got a bunch of level ups. Good. Oh, promotion to Bugyo I just got. Peacefully. Okay, if people are not happy. Bugyo, uh, clan fame is noted. In return for service to the Shogunate, you've been granted the rank of governor within the Bokufu. You may now appoint a general to the office of inspector general. Oh, I haven't even done any of that in the clan management. I completely forgot about it. Oh, 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 but yeah. we weren't able to do that anyway, because it really works with ranks. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. So huh. I can now give my brother... I guess, yeah, not my diamond. I can give my brother the Inspector General, which gives me minus 2% to the construction costs across all provinces, and plus 1 to repression in provinces where this man is present. That's nice. And then we get com Comptroller, Chief of Staff, and Commander-in-Chief. All right, give him that. Mm. There we go. And he gets an extra loyalty. Nice. Uh, all right, so we took that town. It's pretty unhappy. It has a samurai dojo as well. That's nice. Uh, Hitachi is also unhappy, but oh wow, minus seven. Yeah, that's not very good. Yeah, they're quite unhappy. So I'll move my agents back there. And also some of my army. Uh, Ninja also move back there. Oh, and the Aizu got teleported back. But yeah, White Tiger Force. Oh, they're actually not that good. 125 range, 15 reload, 15 accuracy, 15 in ammunition. So, oh, so they sound similar to line infantry then. A little but worse. Slightly worse. Yeah. yeah. So they sound really awesome, but they pro they're not that awesome. Well, they're better than the levy infantry. Yeah, that's for sure. Yeah. All right, so uh, doing well here. Mm. Now I just have to deal with happiness. All oh, right, yeah, these guys are on the way, so they can get there this turn, and then I'll give a little bit of happiness as well. So now they're minus four, which I can probably fix next turn. Then Shimotsuke is minus eight. We can move in fix the shit up and yeah that'll be fine all right good um mm. anyone want to trade with me now that i'm even stronger than i was before <laughs> no this you guys don't i guess no one wants to i'm gonna try one more person the send eyes i really want to trade with you you're nice guys but you gotta be okay screw off welcome are we trading with each other i don't think we are uh oh we might be able to now since we're right next to each other are we not actually are we i don't think so. I, well, I think we're right next to each other but yeah, we can trade. Uh, yeah, yeah, we, we, can. we share a border. Yeah. Do you want to trade with me, sir? I absolutely do. All right. How much yeah, I'm only minus seventy-six per turn now. <laughs> you just you just halved how much I was losing. Yeah, but it's still not that much. No, but it, every little helps, you know. Because <laughs> every little thing, it's gonna be aight. Uh, anyway. Aight. 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 Right. Oh yeah, and I've yeah, got we're, units. we're not northerners. What are we doing? Units being made here. All right. Yeah, the touches actually gonna be fine. All right. Good. Uh, I think I'm done. I just want to share something funny that I just did. I just picked up a. I got like a little cat play toy ball thing here. It's like a bouncy ball, and I just bounced it. It hit the wall, fell on something, rolled down, and then rolled back to exactly where I picked it up from. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that was pretty cool. That is and pretty cool. You know those things that, that happen and then no one's around to see them? Yeah, I know, right? And it never happens again. Yeah, it would never happen again. <clears throat> they're pulling their armies back because they're getting attacked in the I rear now. It's funny. And now they're offering me a peace treaty. Uh, well, no, no, offer, no, offer them a vassalage. 
Oh, actually, I think that, yeah, they can't because they have two territories. Yeah, and I'm going to say no anyway. <laughs> Fuck them. Oh, these guys are going to... Oh, there's another <laughs> army for you. Oh, yeah, this will be fun. I think from this point onwards, I have to fight all of these to minimize casualties. Probably, yeah. Oh, and they're on the way as well. They won't be there for, like, six turns or something now. Probably more. Uh, probably more than that. <clears throat> they're leaving themselves wide open. Yeah, it's it's really tempting for me to attack them. It's just that I'm their ally, so I'll just get a massive dis dip diplomatic thingy bob. Yeah. I'll have a look what it actually does if I do in a minute. I just killed some of the Yari Key as well with my ship. Yari Key. Yeah, I killed, uh, like, what was it? Um, 31 or something. But uh, it looks like I killed 36, actually. But it said 31, I think. Cool. Either that or I'm so sick that I can't read properly. I don't think I'm that sick. So, yeah, I'm, I'm literally just doing do nothing but sit here. Yeah, they've got some, like, that. there's a pretty big army coming there. Yeah, the uh, can I see any of it? I can see, like, a few things. Spear levy, infantry, they've got, like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, at least 12 levy infantry. 1, 2, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, rock. Five, six, seven o'clock, eight o'clock. I uh, it's actually really tempting for me to go for their territory, but I think it'll take two turns. Plus, my times will be unhappy, but it's really tempting. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> this would be ridiculous if you had like two armies. You could just sweep through, killing everyone that was trying to kill me. Yeah. Um, this is pretty cool. <laughs> I can pay a thousand bucks and I'll get gunnery experts, which gives me plus two experience of all artillery units, but. Uh, for 12 turns that, as well, which is not bad, but I only have one and it costs a thousand and a thousand is quite a bit right now So I think I'll decline that. Yeah, it would be nice if uh, if you were actually making artillery. Yeah, exactly But right now you're not so right Hitachi is Minus one so I can move in you you're gonna keep this town happy for a little bit subdue the residents Another uh -huh. plus two. That's good. Plus two. Ninja you're gonna go a little bit exploring towards <coughs> Kazuke see what they have over there. Probably not a lot. Yeah, absolutely like, nothing. It's really tempting. Well, yeah. first of all, get in town. See, this is less of a co-op and more of a... I'll attract all the attention and you just kill everything. <laughs> yeah. It's like an assisted single player. Exactly. That's how you should look at it. Yeah, well, I, I don't mind looking at it that way. You're doing your job perfectly. Yeah. Um, right. Let's see. How happy are these people here? Nine. And I have 15, so I can move out nine units. You, 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 gun, 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 gun. That's eight. And you can always exempt them from taxes if you absolutely need to. Yeah, that's true. But I think next turn it should be quite happy. Well, happier anyway. Uh, no, that's going down and that's going up. So it's going to stay the same. Um, let's see. I have some units that I can move out of Itachi because I put the guy in there. So I'm going to move you and you. No, wait. You and you. Oh yeah, the wooden cannons as in the use of previous game as well, and makes sense. They make your guys move a lot slower. But that's mm. fine. You can get there in two turns. All right. And that means I will be able to take out nine units for now anyway. I like the uh, the tool tip for them. Wooden guns, apparently absurd and yet deadly too. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. It's good. All right, I can reach Kazuke in uh, two turn, uh, three turns. Well, actually, maybe two turns if I can get my general to attack again. Hopefully, yeah. they won't have too much yet. They might even turn back, and if they do that, then I'll just leave it. But yeah, they might turn back. Um, right. If they're sensible, they'll turn back. I would say we can do another turn, but your turn is going to be like at least one fight, probably two. So I think we should probably. Uh... Yeah, I think we should as well, because there's definitely going to be at least one. Yeah, indeed. <coughs> so. Um... This time it is actually my outro. Last time I think I did the outro as well, which it wasn't. Um, but anyway, so I so I um, took Shimatsuke, and I was a bit afraid that the Ida was gonna were gonna attack me, but they decided to wait around my area for a long ass time for the boat to arrive. Another on the move, most likely towards Ptolemy. Um, so I'll probably attack them at some point as well. I'm now aiming to take Kazuki out, and then we'll be uh, we're already bordered, but then we'll be a pretty solid border, and I'll actually be really close to sweep around you and take all, out all your enemies while you sit there turtling, um, which is basically <laughs> what you did this episode is turtling right there. Hey, it, it worked, man! It worked. <laughs> Some pretty interesting fights as well, just getting completely slaughtered. Yeah, the enemy, of course. So uh, that's what we'll leave you guys, and we'll see you guys next time. Have a good day. See you then.